Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Now this is going to be a relatively small video as I'm not well today and by relatively small I mean it's going to be under 10 minutes, I hope. Now today I'm going to be doing a full review on all of Lotta Tomlinson's Nails Ink collection, starting from the paint spray and then the Matchbox collection that she has just brought out. And I'm going to give my honest review on everything and then, yeah, I'm going to leave a link below and hopefully you guys can also buy them. My camera is flashing and I'm having heart problems, but we're going we're gonna to pull through because it's going to be a very quick video anyway. Now, I have a little nail wheel that I copied the idea after watching one of Joanne's videos where she mentioned that she got some colour wheels from eBay. I also bought them. I'm going to be talking about these two here. I cannot get it. In oh, there we go. These two here, one and two. So the first thing I wanted to talk about was the Nails Ink Paint Can by Lottie Tomlinson. And basically, I had very mixed feelings and opinions about this. Now, if I just insert right now the Instagram post that I posted when I first ever got it and how excited I was, it looked a disaster. And I was going to make a video straight away and put it on my channel about this product, but I was really scared and I really did not want to do a negative review about this product because it's amazing and I love it. So I waited months later and the second that I put it on this, on my nail wheel, it looked horrible and then it dried and then I put some um, Nails Ink top coat on it and it actually looks great now. So I tried it again on my nails, you can't really see it. And after I've waited for it to dry, I mean it could do with another coat, but it actually looks great. So my opinion overall out of five would be a three. I think it's a very good idea. It's freezing gold when you put it on your hands, which I hate, but I would give it a three out of five. Now the next product that I do want to talk about is the Matchbox. Now I only have this one, which is the Mint Babes one, and honestly, me and my friend Becky got this and we are obsessed with it. She got hers first and I was so annoyed. We got it on the same day, but was I was really annoyed that she got hers before I did. But it is like a nude colour, like a nudie pink and it's kind of like amazing. The reason why I only have the little uh, sleeve is because it is literally just an array on the floor right now. Um, so first of all, what I wanted to talk about was the mint nail polish sorry I had a moment there and basically I am wearing it on my nails now and I'm gonna give the most honest review I've ever done on this channel it is amazing you only need one coat of this thing and it looks like you've put about three or four it is amazing it's a gel effect and I can really see that on my nails I love it to pieces and the color overall is just amazing it's the perfect nudie colour, just what you are looking for. So if you're going to go for any of them, I would definitely recommend the Mint Babe one because it's amazing. Now, the next one that I wanted to talk about was the Babes and that's Lottie Lip Paint. And this is this one right here. I'm currently wearing it on my lips and I'm going to insert now a clip of when I first tried it on from last week's video when I was filming that. Wow, I actually love this. My only critique about this is that it is tiny. It is like four grams. It's that, what? This is four grams. That is literally my, oh God. That is literally my only critique is that it is so small. Like I want to wear this all the time and I'm having struggles to do that because I'm scared to death that I'm just going to run out straight away and it lasts so long. I went out last night and ate and it stayed on my lips. It passed the drink test, it passed the eating test and that is just amazing. My camera is flashing so much right now. I'm trying to get this done as soon as possible. I don't even think I'm in focus but whatever. So out of these two out of five, this is definitely a five out of five. I've literally put these on today so I don't know about the chipping. I will. I may have to add a review by Becky because she wore this for a couple of days and let, she'll need to let me know what she thinks. For this, again, is probably 
I, I'm gonna give it a 4.5 out of 5 because the only problem is this size like I have a small head and it's smaller than the width of my face but yes so that is my opinion overall if I had to choose between the paint can and the match boxes I would definitely choose the match boxes gold is a very daring color I believe and gold's not really a color that I go for if I was to go for a color it's like jewelry I'd go for silver but I do like it it's you know the, I have had problems in the past so that's probably why I would choose the matchbox I haven't had a chance to try any more but I have got a friend called Abby that did a whole blog post and I will leave a link in the description for that because honestly I am tempted to buy them all but my mom probably wouldn't let me do that because she thinks I've got money issues I like to buy a load of stuff that she considers but my personal opinion is that I am very excited for more of lotty things to come out. Like I'm already like saving, not that I need to save up, but I'm already saving up for anything else to come out. And the only other problem with this is that it is limited edition, so you have to basically buy everything in bulk now before it runs out. Um, I am wanting to buy every other collection, there's only four out of the matchbox so far. So I am very adamant to buy all these ASAP, uh, but as an overall review about the entire collection, Lottie is doing absolutely amazing, I love her collection. Her Instagram is and her Snapchat are the things that I live for. I feel like with the gold one, because I did it on a acrylic nail, I guess you could say, it's probably more easier to apply this with fake nails on. So. I might get to that and actually go and get some fake nails on and then just spray it myself because I feel like I have a proper a proper effect with them rather than my tiny nails that you can't really see anything. Um, but yes, overall I love her collection and I highly recommend it. So I'm going to leave all the links in the description for you to have a look around, especially the match boxes. Look at this. Like I thought it was generally £15 for just the lip gloss and I was like what? And then my friend Beck is like oh yeah and then you get a nail varnish and I was like makes more sense does that actually? Um, so yeah please take a look at the Nails Inc website with the link that I'm leaving in the description and that is my review. I might do a more detailed review on things like the paint can but I'm, I just... I don't have time, my camera's running out, I'm ill, I'm not even in focus, I don't think. Anyway, it doesn't matter, I'm, I'm doing my outro. So thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, again, I will do probably a more detailed review again if she brings anything else out. But thank you so much for watching and I will see you again next week. Bye!